How else up y'all? It's popping what's cracking it's D about to react to this album and preach a bit. It's titled Son Catches His Dad Cheating. Yikes. This is heavy. What would I have done if I caught my mom or dad? Actually, I feel like there was some drama with cheating. I think my dad cheated or something. I think, like, I was so young. I feel like my sister was trying to give me the tea, but I couldn't fully understand what was going on at that point. But whatever it was, clearly they worked through it because they didn't end up divorced until, like, years later. They didn't divorce until I was, like, 13. So that incident that I'm thinking of, I had to have been, like, I don't know, seven, eight maybe. So, yeah, clearly they worked past it. But if I would have known for sure, I would have snitched for sure. <laughs> I'm snitching. Whoever cheating, mom or dad, I'm snitching on, on, on who, who, whoever cheating. Because that's trifling. Like, the fuck? Anyway, let, let's see what's going on with this. Let's watch. Oh. No. Oh, he came from the heart. It came from within. It came from, oh, from the place he, of truth. Oh. You know what? He's like much yeah. older. <laughs> Put that shit back. Put that shit back. Turn around on my mama like that. Fuck you. Oh, yeah. You want to talk about my mama like that? Fuck you. You know, you, like, you, know you gotta be cheap with your infidelity when you take your mistress to Arby's. Oh. Sometimes you like smoke meat. <laughs> Not everybody into pearls. No, I'm fucking huge folks. Small fucking hair. For his mama. That's crazy. That's Period. loyalty. That's loyalty to the to the mom. Stupid but loyal. I mean, I don't care about violence, but because Paula and Lee, I'm talking you next time. Hell's coming for you, bitch. Oh. You would think you're my divorce because someone turned around on me, being a two-faced mother. I'm serious. Ooh, this pain's personal for him because he went through a divorce over something similar. So he said, well, you helped me through my divorce and what I went through, and oh, now you're a two-faced mother? That. Ooh, oh, that's personal. it is. Because he felt that pain. He said, you do that to my mom? Yeah, he like, you fake. You fake. What I went through? <gasps> you piece of shit. You know what I'm saying? Come on, acting. That was the energy. That was the energy. <laughs> oh, whole f***ing shit. Go be doing guitars together and everything else. You know what makes me believe this 1,000% an affair? The woman's just quietly taken. Yeah. If there was an affair, if I was meeting with a co-worker or something like that, like, I'd be like, well, no, we are not safe together. You are misunderstood. No, they they both too chill. Like, they, they're caught. And they, they're not even trying to dispute it or they're not trying to argue back. Nothing. It's just like, damn, we caught. And this feels 1,000% real. Quietly, because she's been caught. She put on her glasses and she walked in the way. And the, but the thing that happened is that he's also heated. Yeah. And he said, I'm taking you and you. She's not in a good position to say or do anything. Because the guy already claimed, he already put the flag out there, it's war. I'm just doing some shit, on top of being wrong, I'm going to fuck you up. If I'm in a situation with a woman, I'm talking to her. Yo. I'm, we're not sleeping together. There's no intention to do that. We talk in business. And her husband comes up. I'm like, yo, this is not what it looks yeah. like. I'm saying something to defend myself. Yeah, yeah, I'm not going to sit there quietly yeah, while yeah. I hear this and up. Because yeah. if I can defuse it, yeah. she's not doing none of that. She packing up her shit yeah. and leave it. That woman is definitely yeah, fucking with him. She don't want. She want. Yeah. Yeah. Talks about it too. You all, you bitch on record. I'm serious. Yeah, I'm going to bat at. Fucking around on mom like that. That's some shit. manager does not get paid enough to do with this shit. This is a fast food joint. Right. She needs a marital counselor. I'd be like, can y'all take this outside for call police? Guys, listen, you guys are going to work through this. Folks, you can't do it on my time because I'm only going to pay $10 an hour. But I'm going to have to yeah, you're gonna have to get out. There's, there's family counselors getting paid $100 an hour for the same job. You know? <laughs> God bless this one. No. Shout out to that fast food worker. She came in clutch. No. Thoughts? Stop. Stop. <laughs> Exactly. How do you feel 
kids should react to finding out whether their parents uh, or cheat. I can understand. I can understand that <clears throat> the pain, especially if you went through the same shit. Um, personally, now you would feel the I same. feel like it's none of my business. See, no, I would have felt looking at his face. <laughs> I would I would have felt deceived. Like, wow, you ain't shit. You cheating on my mama or even on the flip side, you cheating on my daddy. Like, wow, disgusting, trifling. Do you not do you not respect your marriage? What is this? You know? Like I would I would personally feel deceived as well. Even though it's their business, their relationship, whatever. But the only time I felt like it wasn't one, wasn't my business is when they decided to, to divorce. That's when I was like, all right, cool, y'all made y'all decision, and I was tired of them arguing anyway. <laughs> so me and my sister was like, all right, cool, we y'all got it. Like, sure, that's y'all business, and we were secretly like, thank God, because nobody want to keep hearing that, you know. Um, so and I was a little older too; I was thirteen at that point. Um, so maybe that's why I, I didn't have much of a reaction to be honest. I didn't feel deceived or like, no, like the, you know, little white kids on TV, they'd be so devastated when their parents announced they're getting divorced. So, yeah, <laughs> I would definitely say it's their business uh, when it comes to something like that. But when it comes to cheating, no, it's like, nah, you shady, you know? Well, okay. What that As an adult, would I feel that way, though? Mama, all my life. Oh, all my life. My mama told me, like, hey, don't, don't, don't be putting your mouth in grown people stuff. Then I'm not putting my mind on open people's stuff. I'm not nah. getting involved. Look at Apple. You're he both adults. Like... I'm obviously I'm snitching. This and that. So you ain't gonna say I'm nothing? You're gonna have to deal with that. You, you two are adults. You, you deal with that. I already got my shit to worry about. I'm not gonna have to worry about your shit. I don't want. I know that you become, and I've said that before, you become an adult whenever you become the parents of your parents. Nah, I be. So I'm gonna have to sort out fucking my parents and then, I'm not doing that. So what are you doing? Nothing? Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm gonna tell them you're gonna have to talk it out. Yeah, sometimes I'm gonna be like, I'm, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be maybe giving some advice and stuff like that, but the thing that happened is that on top of that, parents don't fucking listen to their kids. They don't. Why? Because they're the parents. What the fuck am I gonna say to my parents? This ain't about that. You know what it's I mean? about are so you snitching or like, not? Okay, well, if you feel that type of way, do that. And they don't do it. It's like there's nothing I can do here, lady or sir. You are going to have to sit this one through and talk it out. Okay, maybe not fix it. I'm not talking about fixing it. How would you react? I'm getting out of her. I'm not, I'm not touching that with a 10-foot pole. I'll be like, yo, I understand how the pain and everything, but I'm not going to go talk to the motherfucker for you. What do you mean? I'm not going to talk to my dad for you. I'm not going to talk to my mom on your behalf. Nah, B. Okay, I see what you're saying. I'm not, I'm not getting involved. Okay. Now, you got your kids involved in that stuff? No. When I was a kid, yeah. You're not. Yeah, okay. I bet you. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not getting involved. I probably wouldn't get involved in that sense, but I think... If I found out my dad and cheated my mom or whatever, I'd probably read up with my dad, obviously because he hurt my mom, right? So, me and him would probably not be speaking much. Uh, you'd have to sort that out with her, but you're not coming to me during that period. Because it's just like, it's like finding out your dad hates your mom. It's like, no, I'll talk to you. If you want to betray us in that way, you want to do that, sure, it's your relationship. Yeah. But it also affects me, and I'm involved in that relationship, so I'm entitled to also be hurt by what you did. And I'm also entitled to not want to talk to you. Um, if you decide to not talk to them, I don't think you owe nobody in the explanation. Yep. You don't have to explain yourself to bear Are you oh, snitching is the right. question. No. And it's also your right to forgive them if you want to. Yeah, that, that, that's, both of those things are Because yes. the way they're talking is like, oh, it's assumed that the, the wife already knows. The mom already knows that she's being cheated on. And it's like, oh, what will my reaction be to my dad after the fact? No. The question is, are you snitching? You see them out in public. You see them together kissing or whatever. It's confirmed that he's cheating. But your mama don't even know. Are you saying something? Our business. Those are your personally, question. I will not get involved. Yeah. But you I would think, I mean, when, Chris seems like he ain't even though snitch. There's one thing you, cannot, you can no longer talk to me about or scold me about. Yeah. Unfortunately, parents are not the best at talking to each other, so sometimes the kids don't have a choice but to be involved. Uh, it'd be messy like that. It'd be messy like uh, that. I feel for this guy. Obviously, I don't think he's doing things the right way, but at the end of the day, you know, he's in pain and he's lashing out, and his father got to handle that because he inflicted that pain. That was his decision, his self initiative that did that. You could have gotten a divorce. You could have gotten at least so about the better way. I mean, I know I sped it up, but I didn't speed it up that much. You know, you wanted to be kind of selfish in that regard, so yeah. And that's my thoughts on this topic. What do you think? Anything else? No. Nope. Let us know what y'all think in the comments. <laughs> what the hell is this? I mean, you shouldn't be the sh** at him. You are on the public beat, but there's a bunch of kids around. I mean, yeah, nobody want to see this, but... Okay, I was trying to figure out if he knew... No, they're just making up. If he knew him. 
You guys are doing too much. Y'all are. Who's doing too much? People that are spraying water? Oh no. I think the I think the couple is doing too much. But yeah, you they both doing too much, let's be clear. <laughs> Like, pouring water on them, that's too much. Like, come on. Like, move somewhere else so where you don't have to see them. I'm not about to interfere in whatever they got going on. That's extra as fuck. But the couple is most definitely doing too much. Like, gross. Like, we'll see that bullshit. Much. As much as I don't like PDA, they kissing. Like, nah, they was doing nah, more than kissing. <laughs> it's not like, nah, 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 nah. I'm going to be on the other end of this. I'm going to be on the other end of this. The dude is on top of her yeah. in what appears to be like a sex position. Exactly. And they make it there up. are kids around. If they were side by side, they want to do a kiss, fine. They want to do a fine. They pretty much get a butt. I don't care. Okay, I can. Do, do, it, do it, a whole ass bottle on the person? No, nah, you're doing too much. Yeah, yeah. I'm fine with it. If you want to do that in public spaces, at parks, in front of children with this family, nah, yeah. You can't okay, let me ask you. There's a playground nearby, and someone's doing that right beside. Is that a problem? It's not a playground. It's a, a lot of kids there. All the time. Yeah. That's not appropriate behavior. And in most public places, if you did that, people would cuss you out and tell you to get the fuck up out of there. So to me personally, I'm on the side of the people saying, nah, we're not with that. Nah. I'm you're not saying you're me and I'm fucking you up. I'm saying this. If you're doing that, yeah. If you want to be yeah. having your girl bent over doggy style, do the ratchet shit at a public park, yeah, that's all this much. stuff. I don't care if they dump water on you, whatever it is. I mean, I don't care if other people do it, but I wouldn't do it. And I, if he does get up and, and knock your ass out, then it's like, all right, hey, that's the decision you made. All the time with the Bronx. Ah. No, no. no, we need that. No, no, that's crazy. You know, this dude was pretty much dry humping her like they could have been having yeah, no. That's crazy. That what do you guys crazy. think of the comments, right? Preach on one side, I'm on the other. Who do you guys agree with? Oh, see, he getting up to knock your ass out. Oh, oh. oh, he got back in. I mean, y'all are weird. You're in a public beach. You do know there's a bunch of kids around, right? Hey, yo. Go to the bathroom. Go to the bathroom. Girl, go away. What is she doing? Okay. I'm assuming there's probably some groping involved by the way that they were doing it. I'm sorry. I think if there's kids around, it's a generally family area. You grabbing titties, you doing all yes, that stuff. Much. You gotta go. Yeah. I didn't see the problem. Man. But if if you, if 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 they the, the way they're intoxicated, I wouldn't be surprised if there was. Yeah, then I agree. I think I maybe you but know what it is. You know what it is. I think for me that's like also extra flavor. To make it out like I probably could have stomach. It was him on top of her in that position like that. That's what it looks like they're making love. Yeah. Because what did you ask at the beginning? They fucking. <laughs> you can't be doing that for the kids. I'm sorry. That's just not a thing. That's not something you should be allowed to be doing in public. And I also know for a fact, if a couple was doing that on a bench and the cops saw it, cops would stop that. <coughs> Absolutely. Excuse me. If you're doing that on a public bench, I think so. it's like public and just laying on top of one, I don't even think that's illegal. Yeah. Am I crazy? I wouldn't know. I don't I think so. I feel like that can't be legal. But maybe I'm wrong. It's, uh, it's an interesting topic. I don't know why. But it's if you're getting like hot and heavy to the point where y'all about to fuck or so look like y'all about to fuck, pictures, like, nah. That about playgrounds? Playground is dedicated for kids. When you have, like, fucking monkey bars and shit like that, that is special. It's always kids at the beach. Kids, it's like if I'm standing in front of a fucking daycare and I'm drop humping a motherfucker. Okay, okay, I, I get that. So instead of a, a, the actual inside the playground, what if they're in, because playgrounds are in parks? What if they're doing that in the park and on the playground? Right beside the, park, the playground or near it? It's dedicated for kids. It's a social control that that is dedicated for kids. Okay. A pool is like, it's open, it's whatever. Okay. You understand what I'm saying? I mean, I can understand that. You have, like, like I said, I was, I was raised Asian, so you have to have a equal woman. You can't give a spectacle out of yourself. Have a little bit of respect for yourself. You would never catch me doing that. I don't like BDA. I don't approve of that. Throwing a water bottle on someone, I don't know. Calling that PDA? Yeah, that's past It's a public. That's foreplay, my nigga. Bu- it's a public. <laughs> that's foreplay. <laughs> Affection. By that logic, then fucking is a public display of affection. Yes, a very rough. <laughs> 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 Bye. Nonetheless, you are expressing the term for PDA. Oh, yeah, yeah, you I are. Mean, that is not PDA. Fucking is not that no is fucking PDA. <laughs> my nigga, that's not PDA. When people say PDA, oh my god. Say this potato. For real, for real. At this point, that's the hill you're gonna die on. Die on it. No, no, no. I'm dying on this hill. Braveheart. All day. Let's go. Yeah, play that. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe my idea of PDA was like. Maybe you kiss in public, you guys, they make it out, okay, fine. Not assuming a sex position. I'm sorry, okay? <laughs> sorry. You cannot have your girl bent over like this. 
Oh, you stop. And they're like, oh, yeah, this is PDA. That, that, <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. not. You did this right. right. Hold, hold up. Hold up. What, is the, what, what is the difference between this and, what and he's literally doing. inversing her and laying on top of exactly. her? Exactly. You don't lay at the beach? On top of my car. Right, bye, <laughs> preach, bye. <laughs> bye, preach. When you fuck? <laughs> I would, first of all, I would never fuck at the beach. You can't fuck at so the beach. So you just lay on your girl right now? Yeah. Yeah, I don't necessarily like hop on the motherfucker and hump the bitch. You know what I mean? I don't like, ah, ah, ah. You know, just be like, lay on top. <laughs> All right, bye. <laughs> I'm sorry. I cannot with them. But nah, that was too much. <laughs> At the beach, you don't need to be doing all that. That's disgusting. Aside from there being kids there, I'm here and I don't want to see it. So get up out of here. So I personally wouldn't, you know, throw anything at them. But if other people did it, I'd be like, hmm, that's what y'all get. Like, get up out of here with that. So that's my opinion on that. And yeah, I gave my opinion about the cheating situation. So I'm snitching. That's just me. But y'all let me know what y'all think. Let me know what other videos you want to watch. And I'll see y'all the next time. Bye.